growing a greener, more prosperous future. This is Ghana's fourth garden and flower show. Organisers believe Ghana's budding horticulture sector can create more jobs if properly showcased. Anissa Awusima has grown up with flowers. Her mum started this plant business 25 years ago. Anissa is now part of the company. She believes over the last few years, the industry's bloomed. From when we started 25 years ago, many people weren't very you know, enlightened about this industry. They thought it was a profession for you know, people who wanted to just you know, work in their hobby. But now I've seen that it's grown. These past 25 years definitely grown and it's become more lucrative as well. Like many people are making more money and it's providing more job opportunities for people. But the beautiful displays here aren't just limited to plants and flowers. How about a little art or sculpture for your garden? Well, if that's the case, how about this tube of paint with its distinctly floral contents? Exhibitors are also getting creative with garden furniture. This is an eco-friendly option made from upcycled car tyres. Designer Vanessa Tete believes it was important her business was environmentally friendly. I'm a nature lover um, and so just the fact that you know these are natural you know in a sense I mean and we can do so much with them I mean we've got more plans as well you know this is we're not stopping here we've got 15 employees now and counting actually yeah so it's, it's been wonderful it's been a wonderful experience I'm glad I'm really, really glad that we, we, we explored this opportunity. There is still time to see Ghana in flower. This show is on until Wednesday. Katerina Vitozzi, CCTV, Accra, Ghana.